I think that the DHS program allows a person to uh, develop the advanced level of knowledge in an area that they select. And in my respect, what I'm looking for is to further my knowledge of neurologic treatment techniques and to uh, increase my skills as an instructor. I do that both with my staff here and I also do that with several of the universities in the area. And to bring those skills to a level to contribute to the profession and to their facility um, that can't be done just by attending classes that are offered on a uh, weekend basis at uh, a local facility. After I got my master's, I was ready for a break because I had gone straight from high school into college straight to a master's. So I'm like, I'm good, I'm done, I don't want to do this anymore. I'd like to travel or live life or anything but be in a classroom with the teacher talking to me. So I, I decided to take a break. But then when I came into the position here, and I'm one of the few occupational therapists that practice in the mental health setting, I was struggling to find continuing education credits that were applicable to me in my setting because everything is so physical disability based. So I would find things and it would kind of pique my interest and I'd have to figure out how I was going to study that or research it or look at it more. And I decided, well, if I'm going to have to get all these continuing education credits and half of the stuff I'm not really interested in, maybe I can look at a program and get another degree out of it and actually find course material that meets my needs practicing in this environment. So that's one of the things that pushed me to getting my doctorate. 